Hi my YouTube family, this is Melody from Home Garden and Fashion. I thank you so so much for being here today. Today we are going to have a wonderful time together. Hi, this is Mel. I hope all of you are doing awesome. Today I am going to uh, show some of my hand decorated blouse. Now this is a beautiful red blouse which i decorated some time ago and i put some sequin in this one as you can see there's a lot of sequin in the hand and there's some sequin um, in the bottom part of the hand as a design and then there's sequin all over the body and then there's some sequin in the neck area as well so um this is not just any pattern i just did randomly and yeah just to give it a some glittery look this is a plain blouse so this now has some uh, glitter in it and shine in it and this good glittery things to wear for the parties so this is a red one and i have used some golden glitter in it and, uh, these are just sequin i got it from i believe joanne or michael either one of them i got a huge package and so yeah i can use a lot on every blouse i use some glitter dimension and fabric paint but luckily they don't come out that often and these are something you're gonna wear with good saris so you're really not gonna wash it every day and if you do wash it that'll be by hand and dry it in the shade so i do have a little bit of area empty i'm gonna finish that one as well so this is a good one and you know this sort of like um a project once in a while I pick up one project so I finish this one and I like to decorate all of them as much as I could so now this is a blue one it's just a navy blue royal blue whatever you call it light blue so now this uh, I did little bit of design in the uh, neck area and then little bit of trim on the hand and then basic sequin now this one has silver color sequin or white sequin i guess you would call it silver color so this is also i got the package i believe one of those joanne or michael don't remember which one and then i did a flower too in this one i did a flower with some beads and this is a trim I used a trim at the bottom and that's how I decorated the blouse and this just gives a little extra life to the blouse I guess mm, but then these decorations are permanent though because once you decorate I mean it don't come out the sequin might fall off but the paint is gonna be there so you could just add another sequin and so this has two big flowers on two sides of the hand and so this is another of my creation and I decorate every blouse like different different I try to sometimes maybe the same but just try to decorate them to match it with the sari because you see sari comes as five yard sometimes six yard with the blouse piece and i don't like to cut off the blouse piece because then the meat makes the sari small and you don't have so many pleats and i like so many pleats so i buy the blouse and decorate it that was blouse looks nice and i don't have to take out the blouse piece from the sari and make it a small so this is another one and this one also I did the pretty much similar like the other one in the neck. I did some flower in the neck and then I used some sequin and this is uh, the sequin is blue color. Okay, this is a 
same color as the fabric but the paint is glittery paint so I use the blue color sequin on glittery paint so it looks nice especially at night time so yeah yeah I think um, I like to dress the uh, party clothes a lot yeah I should be a party dress designer you know just design clothes for the party so that was the third one and there are some others whatever blouse I have I try to decorate all of them I think this one came with a lot of flowers yeah I didn't do anything with it or I did add, yeah, I did add some sequin so not much though this one has a lot of um, decorations up had some flowers so yeah and this one is really I think this is silk one and it's very soft well actually this was mom's and then mom decided to give it to me she said she yeah she didn't care for it so I just said okay I'll keep it I keep anybody gives me anything I keep it up but not necessarily I'm going to wear it but I still like to keep and decorate them so this one is my handmade I made it so this is handmade and this was made for uh, I guess it was made for auntie or grandma uh, so yeah and then they left it here and so yeah I kept it um, yeah they wore it when they were here and then they kept it so this I had this um, design on the hand and then yeah I, I did a good job in this blouse and um considering this was my first blouse making i was like so soft that wow it came out really good mm, and yeah i i just took her blouse and i did the measurement and she had an old blouse so i just opened it up and then cut up the blouse and stitched it and it came out so good but yeah but while going i guess they forgot to take it so yeah um, and i added some sequin to it too yeah so that was uh, my handmade and and then i started loving making blouse blouse making is actually very hard because it has a lot of small pieces and yeah it requires some skill but I'm surprised that one came out really good um, yeah that that um, so this is another black one and this also a gift from someone and I added this design on the hand and this is like a Banarasi blouse and I made this design and the other side I still need to finish it so yeah I didn't finish the other side but one hand I did it and then this was really a good blouse yeah and these are all like uh, I get these blouses and then I just mm, mix and match with saris and then I put some design on it to make it match with the sari and this was like a Banarasi blouse and so I'm gonna have to finish up the design on this one someday so this is a beautiful piece and I have a lot of blouses which uh, really I can design on them so I will do a lot of design on those blouses 
and yeah this one yeah this has a lot of design this has like pearl bead and mainly pearl design now why i bought this blouse this blouse um came with a sari but the thing is this blouse is really huge so i'm gonna have to do some altering in this blouse just what i usually do is i stitch the sides but still the neck becomes very huge but nowadays fashion is a huge neck but um, yeah this has a lot of pearl beads so it has a really good good with the sari which has pearl beads and that's an amazing idea to make a sari with pearl bead and this is another blouse sleeveless blouse i put pearl bead in it so yeah this is really a nice one and i might add some hair sleeves to it I remember one time I let a relative bring some blouse for me from India and she bought a whole bunch of sleeveless blouse um, and I don't care that much for sleeveless blouse so I'm gonna have to make hands for this it's not so hard I mean it's easy though you just have to get similar fabric to do that so and this is another one which i decorated and i did a video on that so this is i put some trim on the neck on the hand and put some uh, vine stone on the hand on the side so and then this is a good trim i got this fabric from joanne this is like sequin fabric and out of this fabric i made a beautiful dress and a shirt and a beautiful skirt and a shirt and i'm gonna share that one day and this skirt is really pretty and the shirt is pretty too mm, except um, the shirt is really little now so yeah i made that one once and I can get the similar fabric and fix it up and this is another one I did the neck and I had this trim I got it this trim I got it from India and it was really beautiful so I added in this one so I could just keep this trim this trim was really good so yeah, a lot of people has a lot of hobbies. My hobby was to buy beautiful trims. So I would go and get pretty trim. And they really do have amazing trims in India. I mean, they do have it here too in Joanne and all that. Which is so expensive. So at least it wasn't so expensive over there. And but it's so expensive. And this one I did it, decorated it a lot. Uh, and this is with the beautiful sari which has lots of decoration but I didn't want to cut out the blouse piece I just wanted to decorate it and wear it with the sari so um, this one is really pretty I like the color too and I decorated did some decoration on the neck some in hand so this is my a small creation hi thank you so so much for being here today i hope you enjoyed the video please don't forget to like subscribe comment and share this video thank you may god bless you all